What's up, y'all? Happy 2020 to you. I know I'm a little late to the punch on that wish, but uh, I wanted to tell you, I've been neglecting you, YouTube, and I apologize. If you look at my channel page, you'll notice I put up a new fancy banner. I organized all my videos. This took like hours in order to organize my videos, the covers into the older ones, into the newer ones, and then album videos per album, and, uh, just blogs in a separate category, anything. Anyways, everything is very organized now, so you can find anything that you really dug in the past pretty easily. It's nicely laid out. And uh, I noticed a lot of people are still listening to some really old music of mine. Like, we're talking like 10 years old, and it, it to my ears, it just does not sound very good. It wasn't, rec it, it's not that it wasn't recorded the best, but it was that, I didn't really know how to mix it, and I just went with it, and I just threw it at you. I was like, here you go, I like the song I wrote, and I love the spirit behind Younger Brent on that. But uh, it was cool going back in and trying to remix some stuff, and I found like, wow, some of this could sound real cool. I can salvage some of the voices and even some of the instruments. Uh, but anyways, I realized I definitely, without a shadow of a doubt, want to re-release my best of and salvage as much of it as I can. And uh, cause I wanna keep the vibe, I wanna keep what you guys liked about it. But in case, if I don't do something justice and you really miss the old song, I'm gonna upload an archive of everything for free of my old stuff on my website. So when I'm done with this remix, I'm gonna post it, take down that stuff. But so you know, um, you can check my website and there will be an archive of all that old music. Anyways, uh, Another thing I want to do this year is tutorials. I want to show people, like, what the heck is going on with all these pedals and what's up with that and that looper. And, you know, you might have seen a couple of my videos with backtracks. I want to go into, like, what make, how do you perform with a backtrack? Uh, what have I learned? Um, and uh, yeah, even some t some tips to musicians who are performing, people who are trying to get into it. And I'm gonna keep posting covers. I'm gonna keep on uh, making improv jams and all that, but I'm really stoked for the new year and I'm gonna step it up on YouTube. I expect you to hold me accountable. Please, if you haven't, hit that uh, bell button so you know when a new video posts. And uh, I'll be very forthcoming whether or not it's something that might interest you or not. But I'll have something also that's just performance, even if you're not a musician or something, like if I do a tutorial that week. But anyways, you're beautiful. Thank you so much for your support. Uh, I hope you're excited. I know I am, and I cannot wait to reshare some of this old music with you. Oh, plus, new single coming out February 11th. Oh my gosh. It's one of my favorite songs I've ever made. It's called Stop. It's fantastic. I think so. I hope you do too. Oh gosh, was that conceited of me? It's really good, guys. No, I hope you check it out though. And uh, please, if you haven't followed me on Spotify either, it helps a ton uh, so that right when it comes out, if you click save, pops into the algorithms. The uh, techno overlord robots at Spotify throw me onto the playlist with uh, some famous people, and then boom, my song's a hit. So that's how it works. Um, I'll see you soon. Thank you.